All right, my name is Ann Bellender. I'm owner of the Flower Gallery located at 30 Public Square on, in Medina. Uh, what attracted me to Medina? Um, probably 15 years ago, almost to the date, um, my husband and I came out and shopped in Medina. We went to the courthouse that located across the square from us and uh, got our marriage license. And uh, we currently both worked for Continental Airlines, which was just emerging from emerging from their second bankruptcy. And uh, he had always encouraged me, if there was anything you could just pick what you wanted to do, what would it be? And um, I, when we, we came in the store that day, and when we left the store that day, I said if the store were ever for sale, this is what I'd like to do. And about a year and a half later, we found it listed in a classified ad in the Sunday paper centrally located between Akron and Cleveland in a historic building, floral shop. So I said, it's got to be it, and it was. So we purchased the shop and the rest is history. So I've owned it for the last 15 years, and uh, that's what attracted me to here. I always enjoyed, uh, I worked at the airport at the time, obviously, for Continental Airlines, and I always enjoyed going to the airport and seeing people coming and going and flying and going to different places. And then I, my second favorite place was coming to the square. I always enjoyed coming out to the square, the historic area. But we enjoy uh, being here on the square, the historic building, you know, as being different and uh, unique, you know, and I think what we do here is a little different than, you know, the cookie cutter arrangements that you see on the internet or at the grocery stores or whatever. So um, I think people appreciate uh, our flowers we directly import a lot of our flowers from South America, and uh, we actually operate a small flower co-op with several of the shops, and uh, it allows us to have some different unique flowers and more affordable prices too. So we have, on a daily basis, we'll have like hydrangeas and birds of paradise, and you know, not just carnations and daisies and things like that. So. And it's really beautifully decorated in here. Did you decorate it yourself or hire someone to do it? Or? Nope, it, come. <laughs> it came like this. And Kathy, that works with me, has actually been here longer than I've owned the store. And she does a lot of the, well, she does all the silk arrangements and a lot of the store decorating. I pretty much just had pictures. I envied people that I went to school with that knew they wanted to be a doctor or they wanted to be a lawyer or whatever it was that, you know, right out of high school, they knew what they wanted to do. And, I was never that person. I, I always thought I liked to do flowers, but I always thought the sympathy funeral work would be sad and you know people crying. And but as it turns out, that's you know quite nice to be able to do flowers for people. That something that touches them, that enables them to think that it was what their mom would have liked or captured what you know their favorite flowers were, and they were the most beautiful flowers they've ever seen. And so it just you know it's nice to have that the ability to do that.